Sermon 96 Admonishing his own companions Although God gives time to the oppressor, his catch would not spare him, God watches him on the passage of his way and the position of that which suffocates the throats, by God in whose power my life lies, these people, Muoya, and his men will overcome you, not because they have a better right than you, but because of their hastening towards the wrong with their leader, and your slowness about my right to be followed, people are afraid of the oppression of their rulers, while I fear the oppression of my subjects, I called you for war, but you did not come, I warned you but you did not listen, I called you security as well as openly, but you did not respond, I gave you sincere counsel, but you did not accept it, are you present like the absent, and slaves like masters, I recite before you points of wisdom, but you turn away from them, and I advise you with far-reaching advice, but you disperse away from it, I rouse you for jihad, the holy war, against the people of revolt, but before I come to the end of my speech, I see you disperse like the sons of Saba, you return to your places, and deceive one another by your counsel, I straighten you in the morning, but you are back to me in the evening, as curved as the back of a bow, the straightener has become weary, while those to be straightened have become incorrigible, oh those whose bodies are present, but wits are absent, and whose wishes are scattered, their rulers are on trial, your leader obeys God, but you disobeyed him, while the leader of the people of Syria, Asham, disobeys God, but they obey him, by God, I wish, Muoya, exchanges with me like, dinars, with, dirhams, so that he takes from me ten of you, and gives me one from them, O oh, people have, Kafa, I have experienced in you three things, and two others, you are deaf in spite of having gears, dumb in spite of speaking, and blind in spite of having eyes, you are neither true supporters in combat, nor dependable brothers in distress, your hands may be soiled with earth, O oh, examples of those camels, whose herdsman has disappeared, if they are collected together from one side, they disperse from the other, by God, I see you in my imagination, that if war becomes intense, and action is in full swing you, would run away from the son of Abitalib, like the woman who becomes naked in the front, I am certainly on clear guidance from my Lord God, and on the path of my prophet, and I am on the right path, which I adhere to regularly. About the household of the Holy Prophet. Look at the people of the Prophet's family, adhere to their direction, follow their footsteps, because they would never let you out of guidance and never throw you into destruction, if they sit down, you sit down, and if they rise up, you rise up, do not go ahead of them, as you would thereby go astray, and go not lag behind of them, as you would thereby be ruined, I have seen the companions of the prophet, but I do not find anyone resembling them, they began the day with dust on the hair, and face in hardship and life, and passed the night in prostration, and standing in prayers, sometimes they put down their foreheads, and sometimes their cheeks, with the recollection of their resurrection it seemed as though they stood on live coal, it seemed that in between their eyes there were signs like knees of goats, resulting from long prostrations, when God was mentioned their eyes flowed freely, till their shirt collars were drenched, they trembled for fear of punishment, and hope of reward as the tree trembles on the day of stormy wind.